Hello everyone, today in this video, I am going to demonstrate a project fingerprint based door lock system. Before going in detail about the project, we will first see the component required for our project. The controller that we have used in this project is Arduino Uno. We have used servo motor to open and close the door. Fingerprint sensor R305 to detect the invalid or valid fingerprint. Browser and LED to provide the respective indication. 9 volt battery to power up the system. Push button to provide the input to the system. 16 cross 2 LCD display to display the output. DST11 to monitor the temperature and humidity. This DST11 is optional. Now we will see the block diagram of our project and visualize the basic idea of our project. We can see two sensors used in our project. One is fingerprint sensor and another is DHT sensor. Here, DHT sensor is used for temperature and humidity monitoring. So, we will go in detail only about fingerprint sensor. The main control of our project is provided by Arduino, which senses the value from the sensor and provides the respective output signal to the servo motor. The basic idea of this project is, at the beginning, a new user should set the fingerprint image in a system. After then, when a finger is placed in a fingerprint sensor, it clicks its image and compares the image with all the saved images of a system. If it found the match between the fingerprint, it provides high signal to the servo motor and door will open. If it does not found the match, the controller will provide low signal to the servo motor and door will not open. After all the connection, this will be the overview of our project. As per the instruction displayed in LCD, it is saying to press up or down button to start the system. Once the button is pressed, it is saying to place our finger in fingerprint sensor. Once we place the finger in the fingerprint sensor, it is saying fingerprint not found, try again later. In order to open the door, we must have valid finger. So, at first, we must register our fingerprint in the system. For that, we must press enroll button and place the finger in the sensor. It is showing that image is taken and again we must place the finger in the fingerprint sensor and finally our image is stored in the system. Now we have registered fingerprint in a system so when we place our finger in fingerprint sensor the door will open. The source code of the project is provided in my website and the link of my website is provided in description below. In this part, we have defined all the pins that we have used in the project. In the setup section, we have done two things. In the first section, in the first section, we have set the defined pin as output or input and in the second section, we have checked the connection of fingerprint sensor. If the fingerprint sensor is connected correctly, then the message model found will be displayed in LCD. And if the fingerprint sensor is not connected properly, then LCD displays model not found check connection message. In the void loop, when up or down button is pressed, it will go to this loop. And LCD displays place finger message. If it is valid finger, the door will open and if the, if the finger is not valid, door will not open. In this enroll section, it has provided a new location for a new fingerprint and store this fingerprint in the system. And in this section, if we try wrong finger for a multiple time, then there will be security alert message displayed in LCD display. So here in this video, I have not gone in detail about the programming section. So if you have any question regarding this project, you can comment below.